Well, hey, ladies and gents, guys and gals, welcome back to part seven here on Mountain Hill with me, my console. And, uh, yeah, I've been doing a bit of logging just um, in between episodes. Uh, about an hour and a half worth, as you can probably tell from the time the machine's been used. Uh, ooh, cleared out a nice wee area here. Um, it doesn't look that big. But, um, these trees are pretty densely packed in here. Uh, there, there's, there's been quite a lot. Um, let me just move this out of the way for a second. Because we're going to be using this area in a second. Um, let's do. If I come over and take a run into the area here, you can see, you know, it's, yeah, it's pretty, pretty packed in here. So, we'll have these logs here, and I have a pal, I suppose we should load, load these up, I suppose. Ah, I'm getting lost. And I have not sold any or done anything with them at the moment. Um... I thought we'd wait until we come back on an episode to do it. So let's go ahead and uh, get these loaded. Oh, uh oh, no, 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 no. Oh, there. There we go. Load them all properly, eh? Oh, got be more than one load here. Oopsies. Uh, yeah, as you can tell, they're safely loaded onto there. Sort of. And if I press that, it gives me the unloading area. Just to keep them, uh, sort of neat. And we've got two piles down here already, as you can see. Them neat and then he runs into them. Yeah, right, whatever. And right there, if I go unload. We're just clearing that area out. You can see we still got 1. Point, uh, ne well, nearly 2 million here. Um, I did go ahead, guys, and I bought that big central area. Let me just skip to the map. 800 and odd thousand. For this area here. Uh, if you remember, this is the area that had uh, the fermenter in it. And then we put down the digestate separator. So I just bought the rest of the area. Um, I'll get rather using that this short, short, shortly anyway. But um, I think we'll be going too much down there this episode. So, um, I'll maybe not use the, uh, the silo up at the animal farm that we're using. Uh, I'll maybe keep that or sell that on, I'm not sure. don't know what to do with it, actually, to be honest. So, let's go ahead, just, uh... Oh. Let's load at the back, we want you to load the front. That's you. And lock them in. Turn that off. I've got the rest of these. Just quick wait. Look at those ones. So it's a nice, uh, nice clearing out here so far. Um, it sort of gets stuck a wee bit in there with when you cut the, the tree, when the tree falls in between them other trees, yeah, it can be slightly challenging to get them out. But, um, 
so far it's been alright. Let's go ahead and just spin you around. So I thought maybe today we would uh, start to work on our pallets. So if I go ahead and go to the road here, come to here and I go to our shop. And we go down to the constructions, productions, and we'll try and find our pallet factory. I can't remember which one that was. Nope. Um. Oh, I know. That's the one there, wasn't it? Pallet and barrel. What's that one? That's gonna be too big for that one, isn't it? Wonder will that work? That looks like a nice mall and a nice building, actually. Sawdust. What's that one give me? Oh, is that someone that gives me the resin as well, isn't it? Oh, that's nicer. Doesn't cost as much either. Uh. Uh oh. Um. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I may have ruined our road <laughs> slightly. Uh, you know what? That's easy to come around. Let's let's go ahead. Just uh, let's go ahead. And go to landscaping. We'll smooth it out. I think. Uh, let's make it larger. We'll really increase the. Size of it, I think the uh, the intensity. Uh. Only problem is, is, you can't see this now. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. I mean, realistically, though, if I want, to oh, nah, it's sort of smoothing it out. It's not as rough. Uh, because we don't want the land beside it. It's not working too well there, is it? Should have put that further in. Ah-ha! Thomas. Um, it'll do it because we'll, we'll do it here. You see, it's flattening out there, but it won't do it over there because I don't want the land beside it. That's a bit of a, a nightmare. Um, I want to bring that out further so I can get into the cell point there. Oh, and saying that, that road, that side of it looks pretty flush though, doesn't it? Getting around there might be a bit of a hassle though. I think that the best way we could do this is maybe just to, uh, to lengthen this out. It's not going over there because we don't own that patch of land. Mm. Uh, I think the best we can do is back, try and back that in then to there. Uh, that's a nightmare. The parcel of land beside it too, it's, it's well expensive. Um, this one here. So you can see it's like uh, 1.5 million. 
and I just don't want to spend 1.5 million just now on land. Um, uh, where does it? Oh, that's okay. They come out there. That's fine. That's. Oh, come on. Stop rolling so fast. Uh, I suppose that's pretty flush ish. The, up to that bit of the road isn't, but um, I wonder if it's going to let me flatten that bit out. Uh, this bit here, wasn't it? No, see, land's not owned by me. to see. No, it's not really doing much, is it? We don't own that bit of land. So, I think the best we can do is sort of maybe go up there. Uh, let's see if we go to painting. Let's just put some dirt in there just so I can see it. Uh, let's increase the size. Get away with this. Might get away with this. Don't want a bit of grind. Uh, might get away with this. It's it's horrible looking though. Um, once we get that other bit of... See, I'm going to have to buy that other bit of land now, aren't I? That's a lot of things I want to spend the money on though. Um, I can always bring the road round that way to that over there. Because we're going to be cutting more trees down there anyway. Uh, do you know what? <laughs> just let's just do it. Let's just buy the land. <sighs> we were left with four hundred thousand, but you know. Yeah. So we should now be able to smooth that out at least. Uh, let's increase the. Increase the size, maybe, and maybe that'll make it a bit bigger. It's sort of, sort of working. We're not getting that you don't own this land anymore, which is always a good thing. What if, what happens if I sort of do that then? Not much. Uh, which means that I don't own the road in between them. Is that what that means? Oh no, that bit's extended. Out. That's alright then. That's fine. I just, I just put the road round it then. Maybe it's not too much because that's there. Yeah, we'll just bring the road round that way then. Uh, that'll do. Should have brought further in, but hey. If I only knew then what we know now. Hmm. So. Let's see, bring that over there. Ah, okay, so it was because that piece of equipment was sitting there, that's why. And I want to flatten that out like that. Bring the truck in that way to it, maybe. Yeah, okay, well, I'll just bring that one up there like that. 
There's no trees in there, so we're not getting we're getting away with this, I think. Just Okay, and let's quickly then change that to that. Smooth out the, the walls this a bit, because I don't like the jagged edges. Like so. What I can do there is I can put a fence around this now. Let's go for maybe one of the in-game ones that we can uh, take away. Let's go there, 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 there. Okay, so we've enough of logging land to last us a while now by the look of it. Bring that round to the maybe right there. So now we've got our uh, pallet mill down. Uh, I need to smooth that out. One second. Let's get that done. Uh, Landscape and smooth, and this area here. Uh, increase the intensity way up. Oh, I don't want to put land over there. Okay, I'm not buying that other bit. Well, I don't have the money to buy that other bit now, though, do we? But that should be. Smoothish, er. Things are never all smooth in logging roads anyway, are they? Let's go ahead and first of all knock out these uh, stumps. Pretty good machine for doing this here. Maybe not as quick as the Brooks, but hey. This is a good job of taking them out totally from the map. That's uh, a mean thing. Just to make this a wee bit more, um, yeah, just so that the um, takes away that sharp look of that edge, rather than just painting it in again with uh, you know, a cliffside or whatever. Because that's close to that. Look. Put some of that in there. Give it a look of uh, 
something other than just a rough edge that it is and it takes away that look at that roughness of it sort of fits in with the uh general thing but a bit of brushing around now oh, look a while left in there Sort of hiding that road. <laughs> sort of. And there, I think. I should do nicely. Looks like that's been there forever. Ah, I came with a map, look. I suppose just to put it off until we line up down here as well. There we are. It doesn't look too bad if I do say so myself. Right, so let's <laughs> try and get some good into this. Uh, this is going to be rough. Um, up there either have I um well it's gonna be easier backing this in or driving this in I I'm not sure I'm I'm thinking backing it oh we're probably gonna get stuck with you see I'll cut that close to there no not far enough close enough We're having the longer log trailer really makes things harder. Well, having that second big parcel of land to buy really uh, knocks down my plans for today because I was going to go for one of the other bits as well, or one of the other sawmills. But oh well, we're here now. Stuck on that tree, okay. Really need to get that in closer, don't I? Could have made this easier, like, but hey. When did I ever make things easy? We'll have a drive around. Let's try driving around from the other direction. Uh, we're going to need to back up that orbit. Come in from that way. Okay. Professional this now. And I'm not sure I'm getting around this corner. Oh, hey! Now we're good at this. Let's see if we can get this straight into here. And then if I do that, and then go over here to where the. Um, I'm probably. No, I'm not there. there. If I click on that, yeah, we've got wood in there. I 
probably get the last two at tonight. There we go. Uh, I'm thinking maybe a smaller dog trailer might be handier here, and uh, definitely a European truck for this because turning circles better. Right, so if I come up into here now, and I go to the icon here, we activate this stuff. Just keep it all storing, so just activate it. Okay, um, we're going to get pallets, resin, barrels, planks, and wood chips. <coughs> um, so this is just a precursor to get our garden up and going. Just at the minute, I think we'd be better selling just um there's nothing else for the resin of the barrels. So um Don't wanna spawn them. Uh yes, we'll do it for now. We'll we'll get another little trailer, we can always sell them. I have to find somewhere to put the market sell point down, but we'll do that at some stage. Um, I should be updated enough that it takes all those items now. Um, wrong one. It's that one there. No, that one there. Constructions. Uh, productions, selling points. And the sales are ringing on. Uh, yeah, that's there, isn't it? Hopefully that takes everything we need now. Although, there's two of them. I'm not sure which one's which. They sell everything in container, it doesn't take everything. Hi, hey, brilliant. Uh, I'll have to go through the mods and find out which one's which there, guys. Um, and, well, obviously we'll have to put one down at some stage. But for now, we've got pallets up and going, which is the main thing. We need them for a lot stuff so as long as we keep that up and going and fed that should be good uh, let's go and lift this truck anyway and let's go down and lift another load when we go and sell it one of these loads and see what we get for selling wood on this map because of a lot of trees so we might not need to uh, keep all the wood ourselves a load from here. And if I hit B, we should get a load started. hanging off the edge that yeah well not my feel let's go ahead now the first one here is the wood chipper again this is just a sell point at the moment so uh do we have logs in our uh sell point thing here cotton wool milk excited shy straw diesel uh, I don't think so. No. It's a shame. 
Um, we'll get wood chips. But no logs. So I don't know if I can sell them there or I have to go in here. So we'll do. We'll take a load in here anyway. This is where the planks are produced for the uh, furniture maker and whatnot, I believe. If I drive over here, it drops off. Go to sell. 30, 40,000 we got for that. Not great, is it? Oh, there's another sale point there. Does it matter which one you go to then? Let's take another one over there, see what, see what we get over there then. I mean, it's January now, so there's plenty of time for logging. Loading all them up, cool. I turn it all the off. That's uh, hanging over the edge, but hey. Yeah, a lot of production stuff that we have, well, well I have, relies on that garden, so, um, I think. That's one of the, the first things we're, we're going to aim to get up going here. I'll, I'll go into the uh, the menu here and, the, and show you in a second. But you've seen it in the last uh, the last um, series there on uh, Riverview. I don't think there's been any updates to it, so it shouldn't be any more than you know any different. Thirty-six. Environmental score. Or okay. So we got more selling it over there. Okay. Let's take a, another pipe in here to the uh, the wood chipper place. Let's see what we get there for. Just been, you know, had small a lot of those smaller logs in the last one, maybe. Oh, I love it when it loads like that. Oh, forgot to turn the other load off. Let's go see what we get for it in the chipper place. Crusher. Well, that must be the. That's definitely the loading point for that chipper. So that must be the sell point for logs. Oh no, that's where you put diesel in. Okay. Uh, as you can see, the diesel tanks beside it's a loading point. So let's go and see if we can sell these in here then, and see what we get for it then. Stop me getting in there, aren't you? And just a nice tree. <laughs> Drag it out the back a bit. Why not? Let's get out of it. I'm gonna find where the here it is. Eh, Thirty-five as well. Not. Nothing great. 
Oh well. But then again, don't forget they're they're bigger than eight meter cuts. Those cause these are uh, twenty meter cuts, so that could be a reason as well for it. Because I've been cutting them bigger. If, you know, if we're just going to throw them into places to be on. It, it's more of a uh, you know volume of logs that you get rather than the, the price of them at that stage. I can run one more up to the uh the wood chipper or the uh the sawmill. Oh, uh, one stuck behind away with a tire lock. Interesting. So I need the back up here, don't I? as well stay around for this and for a laugh. Concentration, pure quietness. Yeah. A little bit closer to the trees are getting away watch them one down. in the car. Bring it down across that. Take that off. Oh, that's some driving. If you've quit before now, you'll have missed that driving. Uh, either way, there's always a few in there. I seem to want to sell for you. Uh, or not sell, go into the, 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 ah, uh, you know what I mean, the, uh, spawn point. So, there we go, 149,000 worth of logs in there. The product will be coming here, we'll need some autoload at some stage, um, an autoload trailer at some stage of the game down here. So, we can drive it. Hey, we can drive it as well, that's even better than all that backing up. There you go guys, that's uh, episode 7 in the books now. Um, wow, these are flying through quick and fast. So, got accomplished today, we have our saw melt down. We made it a bit hard for ourselves to get in and round up, but hey. Um, lessons were learned. And um, we're getting ready for the uh, the garden. Which we'll bring up in another episode soon, because we'll find out where... Uh, uh, if we can make seeds and stuff first, because that's going to take a lot of seeds for that. But anyway, for me for now, I'll catch you all later, and uh, have a good one. Bye-bye.